All right, pilots ready for flight. Drivers behind the lines. Here we go in three, two, one, go. Here we go, the autonomous period. All three robots for blue and red advancing. Looks like flying platypi delivered a gear. Mechanical minds are very close as well. Both alliances get a rotor started in the autonomous period. That is 60 big points, which puts them at 75 all on top of the baseline scores. The glitch team delivers another gear for that blue alliance. Looks like they might have enough to start rotor number two up here very quickly. Red alliance has rotor number two started. As soon as that motor starts spinning, there it goes. Both alliances tied at 115. And they are working hard to deliver as many gears as they can, start as many rotors as they can. Because they know they do not want to be down one rotor when these airships take off at the end of the match. We've got hoppers being triggered on the far side of the field. A little more fuel means a little more clutter. Makes life difficult for all these teams trying to navigate. 58-54, the glitch team had a gear in their position, and it just bounced right off. Hopefully they can get another one in there. We are closing in on one minute remaining in the match, and the Blue Alliance gets rotor number three started. That gives them a 155 to 115 lead. Still very much anybody's game. The glitch team decides this time to shoot a little fuel, try and create a little separation there as the Red Alliance gets rotor number three started. The glitch team, five, maybe six KPA there, which gives them a six point advantage as we approach the end game. That could make all the difference by the end of this match. Glitch team getting ready to shoot a little bit more. Just a little insurance shot there. 3402, climbing up the rope real quick for the Blue Alliance. They triggered the touch pad. Only one up so far. 5544 gets up for the Blue Alliance. Glitch is up for the Blue Alliance. Red Alliance gets one robot, two, three robots up, one down. Can they hold on as time expires? It appears that 6639 was activating the touchpad when the clock hits zero, so they get credit for the climb even as they drift down. Score coming up on the screen. This match goes to the Blue Alliance. 313 to 305. Those eight fuel points scored by the glitch team ensures this match does not end up in a tie. Great work by.